Hi friends, it's Pastor Harley with the Broadway Church. Uh, let's look at Acts chapter 8, beginning at verse 30. So Philip ran up to a man in a chariot and heard him reading, Isaiah the Pro reading out of Isaiah the prophet and asked, Do you understand what you are reading? And the man said, How can I unless someone guides me? And he invited Philip to come up and sit with him. And now the passage of scripture that he was reading was this. Like a sheep he was led to the slaughter, and like a lamb before its shearer is silent, so he opens not his mouth. In his humiliation justice was denied him. Who can de describe his generation? For his life is taken away from the earth. Now, we can learn a couple things. Philip knew what this fellow was reading because he was reading aloud, as the custom was. You could read, to your, read by yourself. One could read silently, but it was just more customary in that day to read aloud. He's in a chariot. Philip has been, by the Holy Spirit, put in this person's presence. And so he knows. He, he reaches out. Do you understand that? And the man says, well, how can I unless someone guides me? For he is reading something in Isaiah the prophet that about one person, uh, a servant of God who was silent like a lamb before its shears. And he was denied justice. And his life was taken away. What was he supposed to make of that? Well, you know, Philip suddenly is elected to be the smartest man in the room, uh, well, or in that vicinity of the desert. He knows what this is all about. Friends, you need to understand the Holy Spirit will give you wisdom. God will give you understanding. Sometimes it starts with just, this is how my faith has helped me in this struggle. This is what I know about the love of God. This is where God has been faithful to me. And Philip also had enough understanding of all that Jesus had taught. As it is said, Jesus had spoke to them about the kingdom of God. They understood that the Bible said that this Messiah would come and he would be crucified and on the third day raised again. Philip knew all this. And frankly, there is that which you know that you can guide your neighbor about. It's not going to your neighbor and saying, I'm ashamed of how wrong you get everything, but saying, I know the word from God that helps us here. Well, be a witness, be a channel of God's love to your neighbors. Amen.